I'm sure Severino had more left in the tank. You see his numbers on tonight's game, but we know with the day off tomorrow, Boone was eager to get to his bullpen. Loizaga actually came in and got an inning-ending double play. So similar in terms of innings pitched, but you would agree that his stuff looked a lot better tonight. I thought he had electric stuff. He had a good fastball. He threw 99 miles an hour on one fastball. It was good stuff, and he pitched very, very well, and as Jack said, he could have pitched longer. It's hard to argue with that now because they threw up zeros, but one mistake, and when your offense isn't scoring, one mistake can cost you a game, and boy, that's going to put further pressure on Cole and on Cortez knowing they can't afford to make one mistake. They don't know if the offense is going to pick them up. The Astros hit under 200 this year against elevated fastballs. In the postseason, three for 24 against elevated fastballs. If we have those numbers, the Yankees obviously have those numbers, and they talked about that, which is why I think Severino, for as well as he pitched tonight and for as crisp and dynamic as his stuff was, he is going to lament that pitch to Bregman because you've got to get that pitch higher in the zone. You've got to try and get Bregman to chase something up in the zone. You're ahead in the count there. You're dictating and commanding what is going on. This is a really good hitter there, Flash, and that's why I think Severino, when he puts his head on the pillow tonight, is going to have a tough time with that pitch. Yeah, and I looked at the matchup with Alvarez the whole night, and we talked on the pregame show that I thought Severino was going to come right at him, and he did. I mean, that was a, a fun matchup to watch, but the one thing that we've seen in two games against this Astro lineup, they're relentless. Even the guys at the bottom, they might do damage, not do damage. They did it in game one, but they put balls in play. They work count. And as good as Severino was in this ball game, you feel like every pitch, every batter, you got to find a way to grind. They don't strike out as much as the Yankees. So, yes, Severino threw the ball fantastically, but Cole and Cortez looking forward, you're, you're going to have to earn it against that lineup. George Kirby of the Mariners handed them the game plan. Just throw high fastballs. And they pretty much executed it. But the one mistake, it wasn't high enough. That's the ball game. Otherwise, you could say the Yankees win this one 2-0. One mistake. 